My name is Georgina Beck and I live in Drumchapel. I'm head coach at Drumchapel Sports Centre for Gymnastics and I volunteer for Glasgow Life. When I was invited to orientation, um, first of all it's quite unbelievable to get the invite in the first place. When I got there it was quite, it was like there was loads of people, it was great to meet them all because they all had different characters and it was good to see how things were going to be put together. So that felt quite small but at the same time felt quite big in that I was going to be part of hopefully such a big thing. I think I'm giving up a lot of my time from my family and the people that I teach sports to and stuff like that but I've got a lot of support from them so that's kind of helped me, made me feel like you know to make this accomplishment and stuff like that I think it's going to be amazing and personally I hope to lose a few stone from it <laughs> but that's it. A bit about myself when I was younger I did have this dream I did want to be Nadia Comanach you know, and all emotional. Just through life and stuff like that, that's never been made available to me. Now I'm going to the Commonwealth, I'm going to take part in the closing ceremony. And it's just like, that's made my dream come true. It's just amazing. And just, and for every single person out there, just, I would say just if you've got it in you, just go for it and everybody's got it in them. Just if it's what you want to do, whatever it is, just go ahead and do it. Basically you'll get there in the end. And now this is it, the dream's becoming a reality basically through just hard work and commitment and through all the volunteer opportunities and everything that I've had through Glasgow Life and when it was culture and sport, culture and sport and working with all these young people. I don't know what I would have done if I wasn't volunteering. I've had endless jobs, etc. But as soon as I got into volunteering and into sport and gymnastics, I knew that's that was where I should have been from day one. You know, I kind of found my way a bit late on in life, but it's just living proof that late on in life things can still happen. And they do. I've represented Great Britain at a few events and stuff like that, but Scotland's my home, this is where I'm from. It's my heritage, it's everything that's, that makes me. And just to go out and show the world that this is what Scotland is all about, it's just fantastic. I'm just really proud. I don't know, it's like the whole world's eventually going to come back to us and get a taste of our culture and how why we feel so passionate about our country and hopefully they'll engage in that passion and stuff like that and it will just, I think, be an amazing experience for everybody involved.